Welcome back to another video. It's the one and only Pocket, and today we're going to be talking about whether or not clients are safe for Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Let's get right into this video. So I'm sure you guys have all heard of these popular clients such as uh, Fake Client, Astral Client, and Onyx Client. You know, they're all very popular, and a lot of Bedrock players have been very, you know, skeptical of downloading these because you guys have been seeing some of my videos that I've been posting you know, discussing whether or not, uh, you know, it's safe because people token grab and, you know, for all those reasons. And there's, you know, a lot of, there's a lot of worry, man. So many people are worried because they do not want to get hacked and they don't want to get token grabbed. And I un totally understand that. I totally do. So let's just review each one step by step. Uh, and just like, you know, try to understand whether or not if they're safe. So astral client, I, I don't know guys, astral clients kind of iffy, you know, I think a lot of people are very skeptical because they have a jack back on the staff and he, you know, was very known for token grabbing people. So I don't know, like personally, you guys can download it if you want. Also, let me tell you this. If you are not a bigger YouTuber, like a bigger influencer, you're probably not as big of a threat to get targeted. But if you guys are a bigger content creator, like you have a couple thousand subs, I would highly recommend not downloading any clients, but let's just keep going. So yeah, Astro Client is very skeptical, you know, people are very nervous of downloading it and I totally understand why, but at the same time, you know, they might just not do anything to you guys. So it's your choice for that one. Now let's talk about Onyx Client. So Onyx Client was getting accused of hacking people because, you know, there was a lot of uh, imposters or, and, and you, know, you know, I guess pretenders, you know, or yeah, I guess imposters is the right word, who were pretending to be them and they were constantly just sending this stuff out you know they were like dming people and you know saying hey like here's the free download link for it and people would download it and it was a token grabber now can you blame onyx client itself probably not uh well definitely not at all for that but it's just still still very nerve-wracking you know because as a you know content creator or if you guys have anything on your accounts that you know you want to keep private man like it's just so risky you don't want to get token grabbed and you know you might have all your passwords on there maybe you like paypal information maybe your bank statements uh, or your bank information and they might just hack into that you know now obviously that's very illegal but some of these people don't care and they will still do it so just watch out uh but with onyx client i really wouldn't mind downloading it but at the same time like i said if you guys are a popular creator you know just be skeptical about any of these you know any of these now the last one i'm gonna talk about is fake client because these are the top three most popular clients they used to be plasmic but it's not really here anymore so we have all three of these clients um, yeah, fake client. I, I do trust fake client. You know, I think fake client is probably the most reliable one because out of all of these, you know, they have only one person uh, who's really in charge of like, you know, developing it. And he's very trustworthy. They've had no bad influence, like no bad situations. I mean, um, you know, we're I mean, yeah, think about it. They have no bad situations at all, like of anyone getting hacked or anything like that. There was a situation with them on the hive and the hive, you know, did ban them for having free look but they worked it out and now you can't just use free look and that's it so it's all fine you know i think it's a good one to use but at the same time like i've been saying watch out so now i'm gonna give you guys my personal opinion so those are like the honest you know thoughts for all of those you know so out of all of them that i would trust i'd put fake client number one i'd put onyx client number two and then i would put astral client three and listen if you're not downloading any of those three i would highly recommend not downloading it. unless if it's like your friend or somebody you genuinely trust then you can download it but if it's just some random freaking thing do not download it okay if it's some random uh you know client you've never heard of do not download it okay do not download it so my honest opinion on all of this though is don't download any clients like it's scary i mean well it, it depends it depends if you are a big influencer or you have a big enough following you know a couple thousand people i would not download any of these clients because that is such a you know easy way to get uh token grab just for paranoia you know just to be safe but if you do decide to download it, you know, go with fake client for real. Go with fake client or even Onyx client, maybe Astro client. If you guys really trust Astro, go for it. But other than those three, do not download anything. But in my opinion, I am not downloading any clients, guys. And the reason why is because I know I'm a threat to get hacked and I just want to be safe with it. And obviously it sucks not having that. But soon we're going to find something that's very, very reliable and I'll keep you guys updated. But that's really all I got for today's video. There was just so many people asking me like this question, like, you know, what are these clients safe for Bedrock? And the answer is, you know, they could be, they could be. But right now it's kind of like iffy, you know, I'd say it's more towards uh, probably not, you know, I don't think they're all probably safe, but at the same time, you know, like ones like fake client, you can't really say those ones are not safe because it's just not, you know, been exposed to anything bad like token grabbing, but you never know. So that's why I'm saying guys, you'd rather be safe than sorry. 
So honestly, would I download a client if I was you guys? It's your choice. But my opinion is probably not. Um, and I know these clients are going to hate me, but that's the thing, man. Just be safe out there, y'all. I don't want to see no one get hacked. Anyways, that's been it for your boy Pocket. I'll catch you on the next one. Drop that like, subscribe, turn the notifications on. And like we always say, Empire out.